Uh, what's up with you, man? I know last fight didn't go how you wanted to, man, Chris, but how, how do you feel now that everything's happened and you had a chance to look back at it? Um, you know what, man? I still haven't watched the fight. I just know I lost and I got my ass kicked, you know? Um, at the end of the day, he was just a better fighter that night. I couldn't get off. As far as I remember, I couldn't get off. I couldn't get off at all. And, um, but you know what? I'm looking forward for, you know, for uh, 2016, 2017, um, coming back and uh, getting some W's in, man. Um, I, I see myself fighting another two, three more years, man, and then I'm going to cut it. But um, I don't want to get hurt either. I got to make sure that it's the right fight. And uh, um, uh, if I'm not if I'm not in anymore, ain't, ain't, nothing, ain't no shame in quitting. You still feel physically you can keep going? Like, do you feel still the yeah, same? Man, yeah, man, absolutely. You know, especially like my last fight, I only had like six, seven weeks of training camp. And I was coming out for long layoff. I had a broken ankle, you know, no excuses, all said and done, man. I feel in myself, and I know, I believe in myself that I can still do it in this. Any, anybody you want to still fight, or are you just going to try to get back uh, back to where you were before? You know what, the main thing is uh, uh, getting back getting back in the, in the fight. But eventually, you know, one person that I just cannot stand is Molina, man. I can't stand that motherfucker. You know what crazy thing is, you know, motherfucker talking shit after I knocked his ass out. You know what I'm saying? Like, how are you going to talk shit after somebody knocked your ass out? Knocked him out in the round, right? Yeah, in the round. The first motherfucking round. Motherfucker crawled underneath the ropes and shit and, and trying to find a way out. Then motherfucker out there talking shit about Mexican. Motherfucker doesn't even know how to speak Spanish. How are you going to claim, you know, a oh, big Mexican fan? Get the fuck out of here. Learn Spanish first. I want to see that one again. Uh, so do I. So do I. And last off for the fans, Chris, what can we expect from you the rest of this year and next year? What can we see from Chris Ariola? Uh, I'm going to come back strong, man. Stronger than ever. But think about it, man. 20, 2017, man, I got to make it a big year. I got to make it a statement, man. I'm going to be 36, and uh, they say that it's a, it's a lucky number, so we'll see what happens, man. Got to make you do it. All right with you no matter what, man. Can't wait to see you back in the ring, baby. I appreciate it, man.